What's up guys? It's Saturday. That means it's Matt Cole Michael Saturday, which is the best day of the week. There's the truck. So let's go. Come on. He didn't sell enough this week again. I'd bring the boss lady back. We've had a pretty good week. Yep. We've had a really good week. Well, usually when you do real good, the boss lady gets to take off on Friday. Well, I think she got tired of being at home during the whole quarantine process. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I was, I was quarantined my time, but she had to stay with our daughter during her time too, so. Got a double dose, huh? Yeah, I had to get out of quarantine. I, I don't see how people stay home all the time. That's for sure. I go. Crazy. Yeah, I'm not. Uh, I'm not the kind of guy that could sit at home and watch Jerry Springer or whatever days of our <laughs> lives all day. I'm not that. Uh, I def I definitely could not. Uh, so we got a couple of new tools here today. We're going to talk about them. Um, what? Well, one's a tool, and then one we got some glasses that we um, I think is pretty cool. They're actually um, they're oakley's but they're special forces uh standard issue mm -hmm. so they're they call them si ballistic they're they're really cool glasses i'm not real big on the uh, or not necessarily not real big but i'm not too familiar what 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 oakley does with uh the military and stuff like that i do know they got some special glasses that they only sell to the, right. to the military uh some guys have have uh, actually told me that the the standard issue is what they get. They get the standard issue, so uh, I don't want to go out and say that hey, these are what they you know. Right. Are, but from what I haven't did enough research to confirm that, but mm -hmm. um, we do have a distributor that is from the military, so I, I could probably call him and and he would know you know what he could get and stuff like that, but. That's them. They look cool. They're bulky. You know, they. I like them. But. Yeah, those just, are cool looking. They got the the. Prism lenses in it. Mm hmm And it's got that cool little sticker there that says shooting on the lens. I'm guessing that's because of the fact that they call them ballistic. So. Right. It's probably got um, even more technology as far on the lens, keeping it from shattering or anything like that. Mm -hmm. You know, we've showed the demonstrations. Uh, the lenses, what they do, they don't, they're not like glass, they don't shatter. But, right. Um, if you want a good pair of glasses, I think these here are, are cool. Yeah, they are um, cool. So, uh, they, they look like they're, they're beefy for sure. So, but there's those. Yeah, those are sharp. Everybody likes to talk about the brownies. So, Everybody I'll put likes them to look at the brownies. So, we put the glasses That's on it. top of the brownies. And this is another new tool that I didn't even know that we were in the making of, but it's a, uh, Auto adjust uh, oil filter, oil filter wrench. wrench. So basically, you put it on the oil filter wrench. This pulls out. So when you go around the oil filter, it automatically pulls out to the size that you need, and then it locks in when you pull the trigger down. Oh, that's cool. So uh, it goes from two. Let's see if I can find it right quick. Yeah, okay, it's two something to four. Let's see here. It should be two point four to four point seven. So and there's your guy's part number. The M is not for orange. M is for mango. Mango. I didn't know that until I only learned something. Learn something. That's right. See, and there's we, the green ones. Those are cool though. Yeah. Yeah. They're really cool. And see, I have a lot of guys that uh, that work in the quick lubes and stuff. They've got several different pairs mm -hmm. um, because you know normally they only have like they'll click to one size bigger or you can click right. right to one size smaller. Basically two. Just I guess one adjustment. You got the standard, and then you can go a little bit bigger. Mm -hmm. Well, these here, I mean, I can see doing as little as um, the small Camry Corolla when they used to have the little small filters. Yeah. And then you can go all the way up to, I mean, yeah, I can see this working on the the filter on that's this what truck. I was saying it'll work on a Cummins or you know a big truck Cummins. Like yeah. A, you know. 
I, I we did have we did have a uh, a guy that was working on one that he needed a pretty big one on and we ended up getting him uh one of the three claws and, mm -hmm. and i'm gonna say this right here i'm gonna show it to him I'm, I'm gonna say this right here would get in there and do it just as good um i like the fact that it locks that size right. so as long as i'm grabbing the trigger it's locked mm -hmm. um some of those ones at the the slip joint you know as well as i do after they Chip wear out they'll, they'll try right. to slip right. so i like the way these lock it's got like a a ratchet in a, uh marks here that way it will actually hold right there right i mean it don't ratchet up or down but once you get it set it's there mm -hmm. and then you got those teeth that's going to keep it locked in so a good sturdy design and of course they come out with green and orange because that's the most popular color so that's cool uh, pretty cool talking um, about colors let's talk about colors let's talk minute. about colors let's so talk we a little bit about yeah especially the blue color blue color we we teased it last week we said that there's some cool stuff coming out um well it did uh we thought we was gonna have our hands on it this saturday we thought we was gonna have the 12 uh ratchet in blue we're gonna have quarter inch in blue and we're gonna have half inch in blue. Mm -hmm. Now, the reason I don't have them in hand, we got told at our sales meeting that they're the, that the company that actually makes our handle source is helping with the vaccine. So they got pushed back just a little bit. Now, some of the distributors have already got them. Um, there was a few that was put out, they've already got them. So get with your distributor, see if they got them. And it's the seven and a quarter inch quarter, right? I think so. Let me pull it and up. And then the 12 inch. I know it's the 12 eight, inch three eighths. Which is my favorite ratchet, which I'm very proud that they come out with the blue in that ratchet. <laughs> but for those of you that don't remember where the blue ratchets come from, I'll put a card at the top. Now we can kind of go back and reminisce a little bit. Cause reminisce. It was pretty cool that Matt Cove made the so i've actually ordered the quarter the three eighths and the half but um i mean right at the beginning of the meeting they told us you know hey we're sorry but you know because of the virus they're helping with the vaccine well what better excuse like well, that i can i can live with that excuse you know <laughs> i i definitely i definitely was hoping to have them in hand but you know there there is exceptions to be made and i'm okay with that and and you know as far as the the blue ratchets go um there's more exciting stuff coming out oh, yeah. um well, I mean, I was, as far as the the blue ratchets go um there's more exciting stuff coming out oh, yeah. um not just not just the blue ratchets there's some other stuff coming out so you know we're, we know for a fact there's one more cool new blue thing coming so it's actually going to be the quarter inch six inch 88 tooth um so the six inch should be this one here um, that's a great size right there. yeah that's that's my favorite size on the quarter i keep all of them just in case uh this one right here it, i think you know you're stretching it um mm -hmm. as far as length i like this one these here i i, I would be so tempted to put a, a three eight socket on that and <laughs> yeah i mean i have guys that put the uh conversion kit in that one and it holds up really well um but it's still a quarter inch yeah uh, body and stuff but i mean when you start getting it longer than my favorite 12 i'm like hmm, i'm going to, mm -hmm. i'm going to that ratchet but those sell really well too so i keep them in stock but so the six inch quarter it's going to be the 12 three eighths and then the 24 um half inch yeah that's a great like so, that's all of my favorite well you know, you know we, the, when they the come out with the blue in that one we were like man. ah they why they go that long? Yeah. Uh, and but it was a test, and it worked great. Everybody yeah. really responded, and then when everybody's like, "I wish they'd come out long," you know, mm -hmm. with the, with the three eighths, and and I guess Maco knew that once they did the three eighths, that somebody was gonna say, "Well, I wish they'd do the quarter," or yeah. "Wish they did the half." So we're getting there. The blue is coming to the market on for us, and that's great. Um, they <coughs> talk, they they didn't talk like it was gonna be a long uh delay in them right they talk like it was going to be like a uh, maybe a two to three week delay of course things change yeah uh as demand whether you want to take the vaccine or you don't um the demands there for it mm -hmm. it's it's health related 
you know not getting into it but if, if you want it you, you want it to be there you don't want to know that well they're making a blue handle ratchet yeah, from Ico I, instead I, I, so, I, as much as I want the blue handle ratchet if they know, can help get these vaccines out yeah I can wait on that blue yeah ratchet. so it's I mean coming. that that is coming that's a good excuse but um so we had the glasses new uh we had those new I didn't even know those were coming uh those showed up last night and we I was like I don't even know what this is but um they're here uh and there's more stuff i ordered some more stuff new from the meeting that's that's it's scheduled out it's you know there we had to pre-order it so you mm -hmm. always know if you're pre-ordering something and it's new you get excited for it yeah. so you know that's coming later on so well one of the things i want you to show today is that magnet i see you got one up there the new which i think we've showed them before which one on here the new magnet right there oh this here yeah we've talked about these i know we've talked about them it seems like that's the new buzz that's going on instagram is these magnets i'm like yeah we didn't show them like y'all behind the time <laughs> i gotta click that subscribe button that's it that's <laughs> it so this is a magnetic i think you bought one for me uh i don't i think bill bought one i bought the did you buy this one? the solid one okay up there. okay that's the one so, on the somebody side of my here lift. bought one man it's been three years i don't know but it, it's a magnetic mat so this here will stick to whether it be the side of the car i mean i i know we're not just throwing stuff on the side of the car but like fenders and stuff or, or anywhere that is that you need a magnetic base but you put it down but then the most important thing is the tools are magnetic uh so they stick to them so i mean your ratchets your screwdrivers right. uh, but the main thing is sockets so how many mm -hmm. times well even taking out a valve cover or something you need like a 10 or 12 um, because most of the time the valve cover bolts on camera are 10, but right. then they'll have that uh, bracket held by 12 for whatever reason. Or, yep. you know, uh, uh, I know on like the Sienna vans when you're doing spark plugs, they got the, the intake. So, you, you know, whether it be the socket, the bolts, whatever it might be, stick them on here. You got them on a mat. And mm -hmm. then once you get done, especially if you do the bolts, um, pick it up. You take it, you sit it on right. top of your toolbox. Now those bolts ain't going nowhere. They're on the magnet. Yep. Uh, I know we have the trays, uh, the little magnetic trays. Mm -hmm. These are great too, but sometimes um, it's nice to have this flat mat to lay your tools on. Yeah. That's that's not that's not holding your tools. Um, and we do. We well, now the way cars are made, nothing's real steel under well, them. You know, the, it's all plastic and aluminum and some kind of, you know space material that don't <laughs> magnets don't stick so you're kind of screwed unless you yeah. got something like that yeah so, so and I, I know um when i was a tech i was about about throwing all my my bolts and stuff up into the cow panel and that's mm -hmm. great once you're until one falls down in there yeah that, that's great um <laughs> yeah. but also you know when you're first starting out you're trying to keep them all separate because you've mm -hmm. never took it apart before right. or anytime you take something apart even if you're not even if you're experienced and you take uh the new style motor or something new uh on a newer car part mm -hmm. if it ain't the exact same that you're being used to you don't know where every bolt yeah. if you mix them all together you're, you're having to so that slows you down so this this is a good way to do that too uh, if i was still taking i'd have at least two of these mm -hmm. um just laying around i don't probably one for bolts and one for my tools yeah i like the way that it's not going to scratch anything uh so if i do stick it to the to the fender or whatever it might be uh whether i'm working you know even well on trucks stuff wherever i'm working this can be stuck to and and, and really help out yep. once it folds away goes away nicely so if you've been looking at these on instagram uh like he said we talked about them before but they're really nice uh if you want to get that part number that yeah, way they can somebody on me with that but yeah that's kind of become the new buzz on instagram everybody's bragging about them i'm like yeah those aren't new like we showed them like a year ago or something i mean it's it's been a while you well know? and you know there's there's some things that i still um i guess people think because i'm a micro dealer i'm supposed to know every tool that we have our hands on but you are well, that's your job yeah <laughs> uh there's so many i there's some stuff that i'm like oh wow that's not new but that's really cool so Maybe I need to study a little more. Mama, that's what you're going to have to do at night. Open the catalog and say, all right, what's the part number on this? If he gets it wrong, he has to sleep on the couch. Well, oh, I'd be sleeping on the couch woo. a lot. But, you know, it, it is what it is. But Yeah. Y'all got a lot of, lot of stuff to keep up with. It's yeah. really surprising. Like, the cool thing 
And I have to say, you remember that time I come on the truck and I said, I wished they made some kind of uh, pliers to remove air lines. That's it. That's it, yeah. And you was pretty new then. You said, I think I've got that. Yeah. And I kind of like, like I had no idea it was a real tool. And you come back here and you dug around and you found those yeah. airline removal tools and you're like, there you go. So that's the thing. I, I, I definitely know what's on my truck. Um, but Mako's big. Yeah. Mako can have a lot of tools. So uh, I don't know that's everything, true. but uh, that's like those. I mean, if I did a little bit of research, I'd have known they was coming out. But I was more excited about the blue ratchets. And, yeah, uh, me too. Uh, some I'm other stuff. I can't I can't leak what's coming out, but there's some good stuff coming. So Yep. Uh, it should be. It's it's hard to have something new every video, but we can definitely talk about what's coming for sure. Oh, sure. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing them, but for the vaccine production, that's a small price to pay to wait a couple of weeks. So, all right, guys. Like always, I'll put the cards at the end for the blue ratchet video if y'all want to reminisce on how cool that was and how it all happened and how quickly it happened and all that good stuff. It's pretty cool, of Matco. Awesome company. All right, guys, like always, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes. Check out these videos up here, Blue Ratchet stuff. If you're not subscribed, click that button. It's free. You guys have a great week, and we will catch you next time. See ya.